How you guys doing? Welcome back. Uh, today's video, um, what we got is I went back to the antique mall. Um, I got a message that there's some more stuff there that I might be interested in. So I went back over there just to take a look and see what they had. I did buy a couple things there. Um, I didn't get much. Um, the, what, I, what I was told was there was not there anymore. So um, before we get into that video, I just want to say thank you for all the new subscribers. Um, welcome. And don't forget to give a thumbs up on the next video. Um, and if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe and uh, hit that little bell on the top there. Give you all notifications when we down when I download more videos. Um, I just want to let um, other people know as well um, that someone made um, a comments on the last video about you know they would have bought you know or I passed up glass or something like that. But you gotta understand, I have so much glass right now. I mean, there's so much glass I have. It's right now, and glass is for me. I mean, I don't know uh, how other people are, or I know you're, you're probably resell, you said. So glass for me has really just slowed down right now. Right now, all the Christmas stuff, all the holidays is what I'm selling. Like, it's just like going out. I can't really keep track of, of what is going, what I got to ship out or what I got to list. So I'm trying to list just holiday stuff right now. Yes, I do buy little odds and ends stuff here and there, but mostly just Christmas stuff is what I'm concentrating on. Because I want everything Christmas listed by the second week of November. And it's just going to just keep selling. I mean, I've had all those houses. I don't know if you guys remember a few videos ago. I had a, a bunch of uh, houses. Um, Christmas Village houses from a garage sale. I bought them all. I got maybe four or five left. I'm, I've just been selling them left and right, which is great. I'm not complaining about that. So now I'm trying to concentrate on just Christmas stuff, the little stuff. I still have two more big IKEA bags full of Christmas ornaments, so that's why I didn't buy a lot of those. Um, I only buy, um, when I go to these grad sales, I have a set price in mind that I that I want to spend, so when I hit that price, doesn't matter what else is there, I'm done. Um, I did end up going back to that sale the next day. I bought a couple other things. I probably shouldn't have, but I did. Um, I mean, one thing, yes, I definitely should have bought, but this here, um, I did end up buying this little guy. Um, I don't know if anybody knows these are nesting chickens the little candy dishes. I got the bottom in there This was actually um, It's a Waterford um, I know a lot of people do know what about Waterford's they got the little marks in the bottom of them This did have it. She the lady had no idea what it was I told her what it was and she still wanted just that price. I was like, okay, so I did buy it I did have I do have a lot of those um, Little candy dishes for the chickens. I just that's why I didn't buy the rest of them. She had more I didn't want to buy them Oh, God, heartburn, big time. But thank you again for everybody that commented. Um, the new subscribers, thanks. Welcome to the channel. And I am going to show you one more thing I did um, end up going back to get when I bought that chicken the next day. Because this was a really big surprise to me. Because I knew nothing about these these little things. I knew other things that le other than these, but this I had no idea. I'm going to switch this around. I'm going to show you real fast. These things right here. Um, they were sitting in the box in the in the back of one table, and they were marked, you know, Fenton Camels. I knew Fenton. Fenton's good, but I had no idea how good these were. Um, I did ask her for a price. Um, she said a couple bucks for, you know, both of them. Um, these are, you know, there we go. These are uh, Fenton, the anniversary, 95 years, um, anniversary Camels. Um, they're the to the nativity scenes, but... These camels, by themselves, um, just one of them, I should say, I could probably get close to 200 bucks per camel. Um, that was, I didn't know that at the time, because like I said, I've, I've done the, I've done the, what is it, the, uh, uh, I want to say the donkey. I've had the donkeys, I sold those, no problem. These, I've never had these before, so I didn't know anything about them, that's why I didn't get them until i went back the next day and i want to take a chance she told me the price like yeah just let me i'm here it's like i gotta buy something else from you i didn't want to waste her time so she gave me these for very cheap um i want to say maybe a couple bucks if that um she knew what they were um she didn't have the whole set this to like i said this to the nativity scene she didn't have the whole set so she was just gonna sell them like this it's like that's fine i took them and i'm gonna show you before we get into the video at the end of this this part here i'm gonna show you what these are going for um, there's literally only one other listing of this camel, which is actually only this one. Um, this one here is not even listed. So I'm going to have the exclusive, 
you know, listing for that one listing for it. So definitely going to have uh, some decent money on those. So I'm gonna, actually, I'm listing them right now. That's all I've been doing all morning, Sunday morning. And I've just been listing nonstop. I think I end up listing so far another 32, 33 items so far. Um, and I've got, you know, probably another couple hours of listing yet. I try to get Sundays and that's my listing day. I only do this part-time for anybody who doesn't know. Um, part-time, part-time lister, reseller, whatever you want to call it. And full-time, you know, factory worker. So that's what I do. I got plenty of room. Anybody who's new to this channel, I got this whole area here. I'm going to, you know, give you a little swing around. It's a mess right now because I have everything set in categories. What I got to list, what I've been shipping out, what's got to get shipped out. Um, new listings, old listings, and plus I got a 30 by 30 garage out there. I don't have a lot out there right now. Just a few odds and ends stuff. I think it's maybe four eight foot tables full of stuff that's about it so that's been sold and cleared out thank god but i'm going to show you some stuff right here real fast now this is all the christmas stuff here um that i've i got this all i got those listed um that's finally listed those are listed i've already had a couple people that made offers on them i did turn them down because they way low balled me um for what they're actually going for which is fine i mean that's the price that you pay with ebay and macari um those are all pyrex those are all listed um, I actually brought them out and I was wiping them out, cleaning them. Um, I'm in the process of listing these here. These are cobblestone. Um, I usually do really good with these. Um, I believe in the, is it video? I don't know if this video came out yet, but I bought this, the whole box. Um, they're individually priced, but I bought those. Um, there's your couple board games over there. All this stuff here is all listed, which is great. This is still gotta get, this box is still gotta get listed. Um, let's see, got a couple other things. I'm in the process of listing this bag. This all is listed. I got, a, I'm putting these in totes right now between, um, stuffed animals, um, books. I'm, I'm trying to break them up so they're not all in the same box or in the same tote. So I'm trying to break them up and they go in storage. And of course, all the clothes I have not listed yet. I just hate listing clothes. I don't know why I buy it. And then this here stuff is all listed. These are all boxes I've just made. They're being shipped out. Um, these are all shoes. These are all totes full of items. So it, it's not the best category, but it, it works for me. So so I know exactly where everything is. But I just bought a new desk too. I got to get that set up over there. Get this old desk out of here. It was just too small. So the desk is going to be like an L shape. So I'll have that with my computer, my scale, everything right over there with me, with my label printer, my Rolo rollo printer i should say so i'm trying to get all that organized and i just brought you know i bring stuff out from the garage and bring it up by bags and bundles and just stop, stop, blah, blah. god my tongue's all twisted stick it here and then i just start listing it and then i bring it back in next batch and so forth so that's that's what my my day is so thanks for joining and hoping you guys enjoy the video and catch y'all next time Gotta get all these. Oh. All right, I'm picking up all of these here. I have to put the video down.
this. I gotta go tease my friends. I just found two of these. They they were looking for them. Oh, know, I yeah. I was gonna say there's some up on the. Somebody just got some two on the counter. Yeah. But they're, those are all over the place. Okay. In here. Yeah. Okay. Yep. They were really looking for them, so I just want to tease them by walking by again. Like, <laughs> She got to sit like this. Oh, I see it. Let's see what we got back here. wooden ones that are cool. Must have got a nose. 25 for a four. It's not bad, but no profit for me for reselling. 
I actually have these in packages, brand new. Still selling them. And I just sent out the leg lamps again. All right, let's go in the back. If I see anything, I'll show you guys. Records galore. Too much money though.
unopened. Not that old. This one might be old. Green glass. Alright, I don't see any more Christmas molds. <laughs> 